Let's take a look at one more option in regards to printing. Now in many cases, when you go to print a document, you're gonna print the entire thing. The spreadsheet, all of its data, the chart, the entire set of data contained within that worksheet. But there will come a time where you wanna print just a specific portion of the document. Like I only wanna print the, this little spreadsheet right here. My bills, the months, their totals, their percentage, that's it. Well, right now, if I go file the print, I print out the entire thing. Well, inside of Excel, we have what's called the print area. You set a print area. You literally select the cells that you want to print. You go to, to a page layout, print area, set the print area, and that's all you'll print when you go to file print. Let's take a look. So I only want to print this little spreadsheet. No title, no min max average count, no chart, that's it. So. I'm gonna select my little spreadsheet. That's A3 down to F9. There we go. I'm gonna go up to page layout. I'm gonna to go to print area and I'm gonna set the print area. So I'm gonna click away from my little spreadsheet there and you probably just barely see it on the screen but probably best to see it down here in the corner. There's a little bit of a darker border that actually goes all the way around my spreadsheet and that's just denoting that this is the print area. So now I'll go to file to print, and you can see that I'm only printing that little spreadsheet. No title, no min-max average count, no chart, it's just the spreadsheet. Set your print area. Now, what if you wanna get back to the entire spreadsheet again? I wanna print everything. Well, you set the print area, you can also clear it. You can get rid of the print area. Watch this, hit my back arrow, Take me back to Excel. I'm gonna to go to page layout, back to print area, where I set it earlier, and now I'll clear it. Clear the print area, and if I go back to file, back to print, I'm now printing the entire worksheet once again, all two pages of it, oops, two pages. Now we saw by accident earlier, if you select a chart and you go file print, you print just that chart. It's kinda of like setting a print area, but you're just selecting the chart, so you only get that by default. So try this out. Set your own print area. Maybe you just want a specific month, or a couple of months, or specific bills, or maybe you just want the chart. Select the chart, print that. Select your data, set the print area, print that. Don't forget to go back in and clear it though. When you're all done, you printed what you wanted, go clear the print area, you'll be back to square one again. Try it out.